What's up everybody, this is Coach Burrow, and in today's activation routine, we will be at P16 in the Gatineau Park. We will do the elbow to end step 10 times, the sprinter 10 times, and the lateral squat 10 times on each side. To finish off with the push-up walkout with the option to either plank it, do one push-up or two push-ups. Basically, do your thing. And on the second round, we will have the option to add a single leg squat to your elbow to instep. See you on the mat. So let's begin with the elbow to instep. Take a step back with your left leg. Try to feel every single stretch. Touch your knee. Touch the sky with your right hand. Press on the brakes. Put your knee on the ground. Touch the wall behind you. Arms up. Get up. Knee hug. Awesome. We're doing 10 of those, so take a step back with your right leg. Touch your knee. Touch the sky. Press on the brakes. Put your knee on the ground. Touch the wall behind you. Arms up. Get up. Knee hug. Especially when we're warming up. Take a step back with your left leg. Let's do those movements slowly. Touch your knee with your right hand. Touch the sky. Focus on form. Press on the brakes. Put your knee on the ground. Touch the wall behind you. Arms up. Get up. Knee hug. Take a step back with your right leg. Touch your knee with your left hand. Touch the sky. Press on the brakes. Put your knee on the ground. Touch the wall behind you. Arms up. Get up. Knee hug. And as we warm up, take a step back with your left leg. Touch your knee with your right hand. Touch the sky. We'll be able to go a bit faster. Press on the brakes. Knee on the ground. Touch the wall behind you. Arms up. Get up. We're at five. Take a step back with your right leg. Touch your knee with your left hand. Touch the sky. Press on the brakes. Put your knee on the ground. Touch the wall behind you. Arms up. Get up. Knee hug. Six. Take a step back with your left leg. Touch your knee with your right hand. Touch the sky. Press on the brakes. Put your knee on the ground. Touch the wall behind you. Arms up. Get up. Knee hug. Seven. Take a step back with your right leg. Touch your knee. Touch the sky. Press on the brakes. Put your knee on the ground. Touch the wall behind you. Arms up. Get up. Knee hug. Eight. So two more. Take a step back with your left leg. Touch your knee with your right hand. Touch the sky. Press on the brakes. Put your knee on the ground. Touch the wall behind you. Arms up. Get up. Knee hug. Nine. We got one more. Take a step back with your right leg. Touch your knee with your left hand. Touch the sky. Press on the brakes. Put your knee on the ground. Touch the wall behind you. Arms up. Get up. Knee hug. Awesome. So let's get to the sprinter. One, two, make sure your knee is behind your heel. Three, and that your four, the right leg that is in front. Five, keeps its heel. Six, on the ground. Seven, if you tend to be eight, tight in your ankles. Nine, your uh, heel will lift. Ten. Let's switch side. And knee right behind the heel. One, two, lift your glutes. Three, 
four, five, six, seven, eight. Feel that stretch in the front leg. Nine. It's probably working at the same time. Ten. Awesome. Let's get to the lateral squat. So we will have our legs the width of your mat ish. And you're gonna go to one side, make sure your knee goes towards your pinky toe. One, and you can grab something in front of you that is stable to help you bring more depth. One, into your squat. I was grabbing a bit of grass, two, to help me really feel the stretch. Two, do what feels right. Three, hips don't lie. They do tell you if you take care of them or not. Three. Four. Four. Five. I like to also use my elbow to push five, my knee towards my pinky toe which makes me feel also a bit of a stretch. Six on the groin of the bending leg as well. Six, but we all know that we will feel more stretch. Seven on the straight leg. Seven, I like to lift my toes, externally rotate my hip as well. Eight. Eight, so we're stretching the adductor muscles, but we're also stretching nine, a bit of the hamstrings. Nine. Ten. And ten. Awesome. Let's do my favorite one. Oh, you don't have to jump to get there. <laughs> Go to the back of your mat and let's do the push-up walkout with the option to either plank, one push-up or two push-ups. So touch the sky, walk your hands forward, do your thing. You can always do one or two push-ups, full range if possible, and walk your hands back. So that's one. Touch the sky, walk your hands forward. Down to the ground, do your thing, and walk your hands back. Two, touch the sky, walk your hands forward, go down to the ground, do your thing, and walk your hands back. So that's three, touch the sky. Walk your hands forward, get down to the ground, do your thing, and walk your hands back. Four, touch the sky, walk your hands forward, get down to your ground, do your thing, and walk your hands back. We're halfway there. Five. Touch the sky. Walk your hands forward. Get down to the ground. Do your thing. And walk your hands back. Six. Touch the sky. Walk your hands forward. Go down to the ground. Do your thing and walk your hands back. Seven. Touch the sky. Walk your hands forward. Do your thing. And walk your hands back. Eight. Touch the sky. Walk your hands forward. Go down to the ground. Do your thing. 
and walk your hands back. Nine, you got one more. You got this. Touch the sky. Walk your hands forward. Do your thing. And walk your hands back. Ten. Let's do that again. And after that, let's go for a run. Take a step back with your left leg. Touch your knee. Touch the sky. Press on the brakes. Put your knee on the ground. Touch the wall behind you. Arms up. Get up. Either knee hug or grab that foot. And dare to do a single leg squat if you can. And get back up. Let's do the other side. Take a step back with your right leg. Touch your knee with your left hand. Touch the sky. Press on the brakes. Put your knee on the ground. Touch the wall behind you. Arms up. Get up. Either knee hug or grab that foot. And see how low can you go. And get back up. Two. Take a step back with your left leg. Touch your knee. Touch the sky. Press on the brakes. Put your knee on the ground. Touch the wall behind you. Arms up. Get up. Either knee hug or grab that foot. And see how low can you go into that single leg squat. So that's three. Feel free to use your free hands to help you with your balance in order to avoid falling on the ground. Cut. Take a second with your right leg. Touch your knee with your left hand. Touch the sky. Press on the brakes. Put your knee on the ground. Touch the wall behind you. Arms up. Get up. Either knee hug or grab that foot and single leg squat. Woo. Takes all my focus in the world to keep that heel on the ground, that's for sure. And get back up. Take a step with your left leg back. Touch your knee with your right hand. Touch the sky. Press on the brakes. Put your knee on the ground. Touch the wall behind you, arms up, get up, either knee hug or grab that foot, and see how low can you go, and five, feel free to use your hand if you need to, find balance, and get back up, take a step back with your right leg, touch your knee with your left hand, Touch the sky. Press on the brakes. Put your knee on the ground. Touch the wall behind you. Arms up. Get up. Either knee hug or grab that foot. And go down to the ground. And get back up. Awesome. Take a step back with your left leg. Touch your knee. Touch the sky. Press on the brakes. You know you'll do 10 reps. Put your knee on the ground. Touch the wall behind you. Arms up. Feel the stretch. Feel the movement. And get up. Grab that foot. See how low can you go. And get back up. Take a step back with your right leg. Touch your knee with your left hand. Touch the sky. Press on the brakes. Put your knee on the ground. Touch the wall behind you. Arms up. Get up. Do your thing. Either a single leg squat or knee hug. 
find your own edge. I'm trying to really dig that left heel on the ground so that my glutes activate properly when I get up. Awesome. Take a step back with your left leg. Touch your knee. Touch your sky. Press on the brakes. Put your knee on the ground. Touch the wall behind you. Arms up. Get up. Either knee hug or that single leg squat that we all love. And when you're ready, you're gonna get back up. Really try to dig my heel when I get back up. Take a step back with your right leg. Touch your knee with your left hand. Touch the sky. Press on the brakes. Put your knee on the ground. Touch the wall behind you. Arms up. Get up. Do your thing. I believe that's the tenth rep. Try to dig that heel to the ground. I know it's hard, but nobody said it was supposed to be easy. And get back up. Now, let's do the sprinter. So put your knee just behind your heel. Make sure it sticks to the ground. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Awesome. Switch sides. Knee just behind your heel, keep it on the ground. One, two, three. Feel that stretch. Four, five, but don't stick to it. Just move into it. Six, seven, eight. That's me getting a bit distracted. Nine, by all the cars coming up and you're not seeing them. Ten. I'm going to have to work on my poker face a bit more. Get back up and get ready for that long little squat. Let's go one side. And push that knee towards the outside. And then the other side. One. Feel that stretch. Two people will tend to lift their heels off the ground. Please don't. Two. It will put a bit more pressure into your knee instead of into your glutes. Three. I believe that's three. Three. Four. Four. Dig that heel. Both heels always stay on the ground. Five. It's actually the toes that get up, not the heel. Five. Six. Six. Seven. Seven. Eight. Eight. Nine. Nine. Feel free to grab a bit of weight in front. Ten. Because I'm grabbing grass and it helps me out. And ten. Awesome. Let's get up however you want. Go to the back of the mat and do the push out walk out or hand walk. Touch the sky. Walk your hands forward. Go down to the ground. Do your thing. And walk your hands back. So that's one. Touch the sky. Walk your hands forward. Go down to the ground. Do your thing. And walk your hands back. Two. Touch the sky. Walk your hands forward. Go down to the ground. Get back up. Do your thing and walk your hands back. 
sorry. Touch the sky. Walk your hands forward. Get down to the ground. Do your thing. And walk your hands back. Four. Touch the sky. Down to the ground. Walk your hands forward. Do your thing. And walk your hands back. Five. Touch the sky. Walk your hands forward. Go down to the ground. Get back up. Do your thing. And walk your hands back. Six. Touch the sky. Walk your hands forward. Go down to the ground. Do your thing. And walk your hands back. Seven. Touch the sky. Walk your hands forward. Do your thing. And walk your hands back. Eight. Touch the sky. Walk your hands forward. Go down to the ground. Do your thing. And walk your hands back. Nine. One last one. Walk your hands forward. Go down to the ground. Do your thing. And walk your hands back. And ten. Thank you so much for watching. You can always uh, smash that like button if you like what you see or bump it. And or subscribe to my channel if you haven't already done so. Make sure you ring that bell so that you don't miss anything such as activation routine. Have a good one.